today, <laughs> something's in my eye. So I've been working on something for you guys. I've been working on a couple of presets for the last couple months, and I am excited to tell you that they are here. They are ready. They are done for you to for you to partake in like a delicious bling cup of coffee. <laughs> Now, this is a different take on presets. What I didn't want to do was give you guys a pack of presets with, you know, 50 different variations in case you overexpose or underexpose, your shadows are too dark. So what I've created for you guys are three very high-end presets. They are made for you to be able to adjust with and give you a solid direction in what you're doing. So I've made three here. I've made Arik, Lodge, and Mood. I wanted to give you guys an opportunity to have a kind of a minimalist preset structure to where you don't have to have 500 presets in one of your packs and just cycle through the one that fits for your photos, but instead learn a little bit about the preset and really be able to utilize the preset to its fullest instead of having to stick with these huge packs of presets. So I hope you guys enjoy these. Um, hopefully you guys are able to see what these presets are capable of and if it's something that might fit your play style. I'm going to jump right in here and let's get started with one of my favorite ones. This one's called Arik. Now the point of this one is to kind of bring out the highlights here and bring in these gold tones. So if you see if I apply it here, um, what I'll go ahead and do is just bring this down a little bit. You'll kind of see that it really brings out the lights and the hairs here. And my main goal here was to actually change the colors down here in camera calibration. That's one of the biggest things of this preset is the blue primary and the saturation there and how that changes it. This next photo with one of my friends. There's another one that I liked this preset on. Um, kind of that light, um, that lighter look for it. And I went ahead and left it on the bright side so that you guys can adjust it down to the dark side because I don't want to start it here and have you bring it up to there. I want you to start it here and bring it on the brighter side of things. So now I'm going to go ahead and apply this onto here. Now if you notice, a lot of these photos have a lot of highlights and a lot of hair light. So if you can see this right around here, when I bring this in a little bit, you can see I'm getting a lot of light around the edges of my body. And this met preset will actually accentuate those and kind of give a glow. To be honest, I'm not sure how this happened with the preset, um, but when I was working with it, eventually it just started to give this glow effect and I really don't know what it is because it's not in the dehaze um, but I really loved it and I think you guys are really gonna enjoy that effect on your photos go ahead we'll take a look here at la 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 lodge okay this is one of my friends Shelly Rollison great musician um, I'm actually gonna straighten this photo really quick because it's actually not straight the horizon look you can see actually the curvature of the earth that is so crazy is that about right? Yeah, that's about right. This one is called Lodge and it's meant to bring out those like hipster camping, like tin cup vibes, you know what I'm talking about? Um, so if I go ahead and apply Lodge onto this preset, you'll see that it really brings in the browns um, for the photo. I love this for mountains, for camping, for that whole like um, wilderness vibe. I really love this preset. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at another one. This was shot in kind of a cabin thing, so I thought this would be appropriate to show you a preset called Lodge. Um, but take a look what it's going to do to these browns and the blues and how it moves those to the warmer tones So when I apply that you can see it <clears throat> just make a few adjustments here. Like I said um, And bring it right into where you want it and there we go. There you have it um, This is another one camping vibe again sticking with the theme Applying lodge Boop. once I put it on there I'm going to go ahead and bring it in Maybe I should just pop the shadows instead of the highlights there and there you have it. So I really hope you guys enjoyed Lodge. This is another one of my favorites for the whole like, you know, camping and hipster vibe. The last one that I have for you guys, this is my favorite by far. This is one I've been using for over a year now. I've used it with almost everything. I used it in Bali. I used it in Guatemala. I used it with client work. This is by far my favorite preset and why I charge a little bit more for it. Um, because I think this works in almost every situation. And this is what gives that signature greens look, the desaturated look. Um, so what I'm going to go ahead and do is show you guys that on a couple of photos. You can see here, this is a raw photo in the mountains. Um, when I go ahead and apply this mood preset, it's going to bring it into the dark side. Not, not, not Star Wars dark side, but you know what I mean, the darker side of things. Because I want you to get your eyes focused on that and bring it up from there. So as we lift this photo, you can really see how it affects the greens there. Let's go ahead and bring it into this one, again with a lot of the greens. So I'm going to go ahead and apply this as one of my friends, Josh. And what I want you to really know is take is look what it does to these like neons greens, right? So when I pull these in, it's gonna desaturate them. It's gonna bring the luminance down, but not make your greens disappear, which is one of the things that I love about this preset. 
this one will really showcase what it does with the greens as there is literally green over this entire photo and a watch as I apply this watch especially these areas right here see how this is very very bright right around here now when I apply this preset watch this change if it loads okay now you can see it has almost a it's almost it turns it from like neon greens to like these deep jungle greens and honestly I can't get enough of this preset I love this one and I think you guys are really gonna enjoy this even for street vibes city vibes I've used it for all kinds of stuff and here's another example of a still life I have with the Chemex taken up in the mountains of Colorado um, once I apply this preset it just oh my gosh I love looking at these photos because it really gets rid of colors that don't fit and brings everything together to a match almost like a minimalist color palette to where it's not gonna hang on to crazy blues and magentas um, but one thing I do want to note this is a very short video I'm really 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 excited to announce this launch for you guys I've worked super hard on getting the website ready getting little videos for you guys to really understand the presets and to make sure these presets are good presets it's a single preset so I know how important it is that it's a good quality preset and not just like 50 different ones for you to click through um, for today I'm gonna be launching these um, I'm gonna be giving 20% <clears throat> off code down below if you guys are interested in purchasing them what I'm actually gonna be doing as well is every Sunday I'm gonna be posting a photo and giving away a pack of my presets all you have to do is follow me on Instagram and comment on the photos that I post on Sundays and I'm gonna be giving one of you guys every Sunday a pack of all of my free sets totally free and I really hope you guys enjoy these and I don't know what else to say I'm gonna drink more coffee mm, 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 mm. you guys are gonna love these I really hope you guys love these I really do if you don't tell me and I'll fix them and refund you whatever you want whatever you want all right, I hope you guys enjoy the presets I hope you guys enjoyed the video I hope that I get sleep tonight my eyeballs hurt Ugh. Okay, bye-bye.